Air Force. Let's get over to meteorologist Lauren Whitney and Lauren. It was so hot out there today. So hot and it was officially the hottest day of the year so far here in Denver with 95 degrees, 98 here downtown. I'm still a little toasty from being up on the rooftop. 82 is the normal, so we continue to be well above that and we're going to stay well above that for, uh, once we get back into the weekend. But tomorrow we actually will be at normal. We have 85 right now from our weather watcher Ed Powers in Marshdale and across the state. It's still really toasty. I mean, it's 99 still in Pueblo, 97 in La Junta, 96 in Lamar, 98 still in Greeley. We're in the 80s in the high country and then 80s to the 90s off to the west. Taking a look at our drop monitor updated today, and it's really a tale of two sides of the state. Front range eastern plains, we are totally eradicated from the drought. So about 54% of the state is drought free. Doesn't mean it won't come back, but we are drought free for now. Meanwhile, the western side of the state, we've seen our exceptional drought grow 1% in the last week. So it's obviously still a really bad situation in western Colorado. So fire danger remains very high out there. It's been a very windy day, so it's gusty all the way from Steamboat through Craig down towards Cortez and Durango. We're windy off to the Front Range and Eastern Plains, and it is an issue for that fire burning south of Denver. But again, the real big wind and the real bad conditions are off to the west. We do have a red flag warning in place through midnight tonight because the wind will still stay strong well into the evening. We actually have a high wind warning for Moffitt and Rio Blanco counties through 9 o'clock tonight with gusts up to 60 miles an hour and then parts of the western slope and I-70. We have a wind advisory through 9 o'clock tonight for those gusty winds as well. It's just a bad situation off to the west. So we do have a cold front that's going to work its way through tomorrow. So we do have an air quality alert still through midnight tonight. But with that front moving through and a little bit more wind, we should see some of this bad air push out of here a bit more. So still in place as uh, for the same areas that we have been seeing the last couple of days. But again, it should get a little bit better tomorrow. Doesn't mean the air quality is not going to get bad again, but we should get a little relief. Now it's going to be a little chilly in western Colorado tonight. 32 in Craig. We have 35 in Steamboat, 36 in Frisco, and then we have 54 here in Denver. 60s as we head off to the western side of the state. And then we cool off tomorrow with that cold front down to 82. A normal day. It will actually be where we should be for this time of year. 83 in Fort Collins and Greeley. We have the 80s out east, 70s, 80s in the high country with the 80s to the 90s off to the West. Now, looking at this five day forecast, unfortunately, that's not going to last for too long. So enjoy that 82 while it lasts because it's certainly going to be a bit toasty around here very quickly. Low 90s throughout the weekend, but then we're in the upper 90s on Monday and Tuesday. Now, with warm temperatures like this, you may be wondering. What's the long range forecast looking like as we head into the winter? Now, there aren't really very many good computer models out there, but I have one very good future cast for us coming. My husband and I are expecting our first baby <laughs> Yay! coming in December. So you might notice me covering up a little bit more of Eastern Congrats. Colorado here very quickly. Oh my gosh, that's this is just so the exciting. forecast we needed. <laughs> yeah, so some good news to go with, uh, you know, oh, all the that heat. That is so great. Thank Congratulations. You. Congratulations. We don't know what it is yet, so we're going to find out in a couple weeks, and so we're very excited. And oh. you're going to let the rest of us know. Of course, I'll post all over social media for sure. <laughs> we know we're all going to be talking about it. Oh, and you're I'm so, so excited for you. Thank you. It's awesome. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. All right.